Hi everyone, Melanie Gonzalez here with the Schlick Gonzalez Real Estate Team. So a friend of mine told me that her in-laws are coming into town and she asked my advice on which restaurant they should go to while they're in town. So I said, well, it depends on what kind of impression that you want to leave them. She said, I don't understand. I said, okay, I'm gonna give you four options. Number one, food so good you don't have to speak to each other. That one goes to the Crab Stop. If you haven't been there before, you have to go. It is a hands-on food experience. The crab legs are amazing, finger looking good. So bring wet wipes for afterwards because you don't want to be shaking your in-laws hands with you know a bunch of saliva on them. Number two, ambiance restaurant. Ambiance and good food, I'll, I'll call it both. That goes to Ocean Grill, hence the name, it's on the ocean. You can call ahead, you can usually get a table with a view, and that place, it's one of the oldest restaurants in Vero Beach, and it's really the ambiance that gets a lot of people. I mean, the food is really good, but you know, you can get good food a lot of places, but this one, the, the ambiance just is killer. So number three is a little bit of Latin flair. I love Latin food, and that one goes to the Wave. It's in Costa de Estes Hotel. It's also on the ocean, but it's not necessarily an ocean view. Um, you, if you like ceviche, you have to try their ceviche sampler. It is so good. Number four, lunch. I only need to make one suggestion for lunch because it's the only one I got in my arsenal of, of restaurants. Casey's Place. You can't go wrong with a good burger, and Casey's Place burgers are undeniably delicious. So if you're bringing your in-laws in town and you want to impress them with some amazing food, those are my choices.